What's up, Zombie Slayers? This is KJ48, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Difficulty Rising. Day 4, KJ48 rises again. So far, I probably shouldn't be mentioning this, but so far I'm doing alright, you know? I uh, don't have a lot of zombie kills, not a lot of experience, but, you know, I'm taking it easy and trying not to die. Alright, past, uh, what, three episodes we were doing the Dijon Tower. I've made my decision. We're not going to go back to the Dijon Tower today. I did write down... The Zhang Tower done on day three. Was it two or three videos? I don't remember. Too many. That's all I'm saying. Um, <laughs> the Zhang Tower was done on day three. That gives us four, five, six, seven, eight, five days, I think, for the zombies to respawn. So what we're going to do is on Horde Night, um, after Horde Night, uh, wait, actually, no, Horde Night's on day. We go back on day seven. We'd have to go back before day seven. Crap, I didn't think about that. Oh, well, whatever. I'm going to think about it. <laughs> well, I was going to go back on day seven. I was like, oh, Horde Night. And then day seven, I can go back. Well, no, day seven is not Horde Night. Horde Night starts on day seven, ends on day eight. So, um, I don't know. I guess, I guess it's five five days for the zombies is what I've heard. Um, so, we'll just have to kind of see about that. Um, I did go ahead and break into the safe season of the lockpick. So, let's see what these bad boys got. All right. That's not bad. Come on, give me a gun. Like a real gun. Man. Well, at least you give me ammo for the gun I need. Yeah, I need, um, I need a pistol or a shotgun or something. Because um, the AK is cool, but I'm not finding enough uh, enough ammo for it. Um, the double-barreled shotgun, I don't love it, but it would be pretty cool. Um, but that stuff is pretty good, too. Uh, so we could put these two. We could probably scrap those as well. That's seven, six, and five. Uh, actually, I'm going to put those right into the fire. Get more, uh, more from it that way. We did get a crossbow, so that's pretty cool. Do I love the crossbow? I don't know. We're going to find out. I'm going to put all this stuff away. Hold on. to. The, I think I have some more crossbow bolts in here. There we go. So we've got a good amount of crossbow bolts. Um, I do not have a lot of feathers. I know I have a lot of feathers. I think I left them in one of my drop chests. So that's a bit of a bummer. I don't love the stun baton. And we don't need that ammo. And we don't need that iron. And I did go ahead and make a repair kit. And I cooked up a bunch of iron. All right. So here's the deal, guys. This is the reason I'm not going back to the Zhang Tower. We need to... Um, we need to... Number one concern has got to be Horde Knight at this point. We've got to start thinking about Horde Knight. I have an idea what I want to do in Horde Knight, but I don't want to do it with the awful tools um, that the game gives you. So, uh, you know, like, if, if to start off with, like, the stone axe and stuff is just absolutely just horrendous for me. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on getting better tools. And what I'm going to do, I'm, how I'm going to get these better tools is I'm going to do quests and hope I get the better tools. Um, I probably, uh, there's two things I want. I want better tools. I want a bike, bicycle. Those are my two number one concerns. Um... I also, they see the thing is, here's the problem. I could take my next level up and put, um, I could take my next level up and put a point into minor 69, I think it's called. And that would allow me to make, make good tools. Or I could take that point and put it in the bicycle and start working on the bicycle. Honestly, I kind of want the bicycle because the fact of the matter is I don't like the buried treasure quest. I think they're boring. And the other quests are, like, really far away. So I'm going to want a bicycle to get to those quests. So I think in order, and I've got a lot of stuff to do in a very short amount of time. I think I'm looking at, um, hold on a sec. I gotta, whew, I gotta get ready. I gotta get set up mentally. I think I'm looking at bicycle and then tools. And I'm hoping that I'll get, I'll get tools from turning in trader quests. So I can work on the trader quests and uh, hopefully get tools that way. And then work on the bike as well. All right. I think I need a um, workbench for the bike, but I did get the workbench schematic. I don't know if my trader has a workbench. Does he? I didn't write it down. So, I don't know. All right, so this is going to be a little dangerous here because we got some zombies in the area and no doorways to block them out. <laughs> I really like that doorway thing with the hatches, man. That's really cool. And it's like that's what this series is all about. Like you play like you play this series and you put yourself to the test. And, you know, you just, it's all about, it's all about, for me, my, my mind. Like, you know, I'm 43-year-old gamer. I don't have the reflexes to be, like, super duper, you know, gamer type where, oh, I'm just going to no scope 361 shot or whatever it's, whatever you kids are calling these days, 360 no scope. Um, yeah, I'm not going to be doing that. So, I need to use my brain. And that's what I love about this game because it allows you to use your brain. And that's why I'm really loving this series as well. Alright, so when you put one point into, um, did you guys know that? Maybe I will do more, maybe I will do more of the, uh, trader quests, or the, uh, buried treasure quests, because, like, when you put one point into buried treasure, I'm pretty sure, into, um, hold on, hold on. 
There you go. When you put one point into Lucky Looter, it, it I think it's broken, honestly. Because look at how much it shrunk with only one point of Lucky Looter. That is 100% broken. Thank God. <laughs> that is awesome. Okay. Well, I don't know. Maybe I will do more of these. I actually got a good shovel, too. I mean, it's not steel, but... I, I do need the clay as well. Who knows? Maybe we'll do more of these. I'm not, you know... I don't know. Man, I, I'm always against buried treasure. I'm like, oh, it's boring, blah, blah, blah. But I don't know. In this situation, I think it makes sense. Okay. Where are you, stupid treasure? I know you're around here somewhere. Come on. Come to Papa. There it is. Is it there? It looks like it's there. Yep, it's right there. Okay. But I need to give myself a way out. So first things first, let's pick these up. Okay. And where are we going to run once we start running? We are going to run this way. All right. Very good. All right. Well, I don't know, guys. Like I said, buried treasure. Eh, maybe it's pretty good. <laughs> maybe it's pretty good. All right. Okay. You guys said that the zombies don't come after me until I actually loot it. So I didn't have to run off as quickly as I did last time. I could actually take some time and look at the loot. And that's some good loot. And another thing I'm going to get from uh, quests is food. And um, more food. Food, food, and more food. Um, okay, so uh, Dan said you got the hobo stew, which is the best uh, dish in the game. Um, the hobo stew is pretty dope. I'm not going to lie. But then he said grilled meat, which is the cheapest. The grilled meat has 10 fullness at a 4% chance of food poisoning. Why would you use your meat on that stuff? Like, I would just like, okay, bacon and eggs. Yeah, I'd have to loot eggs. I get it. And I don't have a lot of eggs. As a matter of fact, I don't have enough eggs to make one thing of bacon and eggs. Fair enough. Uh, but the thing is, but the thing is, there's other things I can use meat for. I don't know. I just, I think I could live off canned food until I get better dish. Like the, st like the steak and, or um, steak and potato dish you know that uses there's a lot of dishes that use meat and i just feel like making grilled meat is a real waste i wouldn't do it unless i really really had to it just doesn't, that doesn't make much sense to me you know like i said 10 percent fullness for four percent food poisoning chance that's an awful ratio <laughs> that's an awful ratio um that's another thing i was thinking about doing the hamalachi magachi tower um honestly i don't know how to say the, how to say the name of that tower so i butcher it like that on purpose um it's ha hamagachi is that how you say it i think it's the hamagachi tower anyway i like my sayings better hamalachi magachi tower um that is the place to go when i'm done doing quests that's where i'm going because i will get healing items there and i will get food items there oh it's not time um and you might be asking cage what do you mean about food items it's a you know it's not, it's not a food place. It's a, uh, it's a, um, a medical place, right? That's true. But the thing is you can get vitamins there and you can take the vitamins and eat the sham sandwiches. Boom. Boom. I've got like 10 sham sandwiches, man. That's like two days worth of food, free food. All I got to do is get the vitamins. Vitamins make it so you can't get sick. And then you eat those sham sandwiches, you know, bada boom, Bob's your uncle. You get to go. Trader Joel's is now open. All right. Oh boy. Here we go. There we go. She's trying to sneak up on me, huh? Not cool, lady. Not cool. Come on, hit her in the head, bro. Oh, that's, that looked like it was a headshot. Maybe it was a glancing blow. Oh, God, I'm out of stamina. I'm not running into the traitor thing. That's a pansy move. I ain't doing it. All right, come on. There you go. Boom! Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, another thing I get in the Hamalachi Magachi Tower is beakers. Or, uh, and I need beakers really badly to turn um, bones into glue. You don't need beakers to turn bones into glue, but the fact of the matter is I'm not going to waste bones. Because, um... What was working over here? Just a forge, I guess. No, nothing was working. Uh, the thing is, if you, use, um, if you don't use a beaker, then it costs you more bones. So, I'm going to wait for a beaker. Should be alright. Welcome to the many thanks. You've proved mm. very resourceful. Here's that's not great rewards. Well, it's pretty good. It's not really what I'm looking for, though. I mean, that's actually a pretty big upgrade, but... <laughs> right, you got any more jobs, bro? Oh, here we go. A fetch one that's go. Oh, should I do buried supplies or should I do fetch quests? I think fetch quests are more fun, but buried supplies are definitely easier. I'm going to stick with the buried supplies for now. 
I really Look at that. Me taking buried man. supplies over a fetch quest, huh? All right. Uh, we're going to go ahead and sell this. And let's see what this guy's got. All right, guys. I'm going to give you a quick look through stuff. If you care, go ahead and pause the video. There's one thing and one thing only I care about. And I will show you. I wanted that glue. I'm not going to buy it. And I will let you know why in a second. Go ahead and pause the video. Pause the video if you care. Okay, check this out, guys. Freaking steel nux. Level 3 steel nux. 2400. Hells to the freaking yeah. Let's get that. I want that today. I want that today. Damn it. So that's what I think we're going to go for. We're going to go for the steel nux. And then, oh, look at this. I'm running out. I don't even know where my freaking quest is. Uh, let's go ahead and drink something really quickly. Please don't make me sick. Uh, we're going to go ahead and eat something as well. Uh, I, I am going to have to buy canned food. That's... I'm getting those steel knocks, guys. I'll freaking starve to death to get those steel knocks. Hell yeah, I will. Alright. So it looks like it's way out here. Somewhere I've never been. Hopefully it's not that dangerous. Oh, man. Steel knocks! How much am I going to get for this quest? 500, right? Two more quests. Yeah, two more quests. Uh, we could do it. Right? We could do it, guys. I have faith in us. By the way, I went ahead and made um, stone crossbow bolts because I'm going to save the iron ones for uh, tougher tougher foes, you know? Maybe once I start, like, uh, you know, like, maybe I'll carry both. I don't really know. I don't, I don't think I like the idea of using up two inventory. Oh, boy. See, that's the kind of guy I would use a, a steel crossbow bolt on if he was, um, if he was a sleeper. Uh, what the hell was I saying? Um, yeah, because, like, I don't know. Just using the iron ones on guys I'm going to one-shot anyway feels like a waste of time. So, keep a lookout for birds' nests. Birds' nests. Where are they? Yeah, this isn't going to be that bad. This isn't going to be that bad. I give me the level. I already got the level. You know what? We're going for Grease Monkey Bicycle. There we go. The next one will go into, um, uh, unless I get a tool, unless I get an iron pick or something like that, or steel pick, uh, the next point is going to go into um, uh, probably minor 69er. Although, now that like, here's the thing, guys. I haven't put any points into Brawler because I it is Brawler, right? I think it's Brawler. I haven't put any points into Brawler yet because um, oh, this is a weird thing to find out here. Um, because I've been using the Stone Sledgehammer, it's so much better than anything I'd be able to get with Brawler. But now we're gonna start pumping up the Brawler. Hell yeah, we are. I've been having a real hard time with duct tape, man. That's why it's I wanted to buy that glue, but I don't know. This this is just so much more important. Getting those steel knocks. Remember, remember my, remember uh, a couple of seasons ago when I was doing Brawler for the first time, and it took me freaking forever to get the steel knocks. Right? I didn't forget. Pepperidge Farm remembers. Okay. I'm not even gonna put down the things because don't really think it's needed. Let's find this thing. This one was a little tougher. A little tougher. Not too bad though. All right, what you got? Cool. More food. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Coming through. I'm a little encumbered now, which is not good. Encumber encumbrance is not, like, the biggest deal in the world in this game. But when you're on the harder difficulties like this, it, yeah. It, um, it makes a difference. I don't know if there's anything. Yeah, let's go ahead and eat this. There we go. That'll help a little bit. Oh, I made a, um, I made a uh, cargo pocket mod during the night, which is great. That was a great find. That's schematic. Um, problem is I didn't have enough duct tape to make more than one. But that's okay, man. Those, part, those pocket mods go in your clothes. Um, I think in your your shirt and your pants and somewhere else. Maybe in the helmet? I don't know where the second... Maybe in the face mask? I don't remember where the third one goes, but... Oh, God. Shut the frick. I can't believe I didn't meet my phone. Oh, my God. Sorry, guys. One second. There we go. Shut the hell up. Stupid phone. Nobody likes you. You could go to hell with the timer. So you see what kind of reward we get this time. You did it. Great job, Ugh. traveler. Needle and thread. So yeah, I think I should go with the uh, first aid bandages here. Not great, man. Not great rewards there, buddy. I mean, not terrible. I've seen worse, but... Man. Um, yeah, I guess we'll do another buried supplies. I'm in a bit of a quandary. Can you... Well, there's now, you know what? Tomorrow. To hell with that. 
First of all, uh, let's go ahead and sell this. And we will learn that. And is there anything else I want to sell here? Uh, I'm not going to drink coffee. Uh, I don't really see anything else I want to sell. Much obliged, stranger. So let's go ahead and learn this. I'm going to clear my inventory. We're actually going to do the... Um, we're gonna do the uh, the fighting zombies quest. I don't want I don't want to do all buried treasure quests. It gets boring after a while. Gas station sounds fun. And we're back up to twenty one hundred. So the next quest will absolutely get us what we need. All right, we're almost to the gas station. Go ahead and loot this car really quick. I wonder what's in that building right there. That's an interesting little little building there. Oh look at that. Look at that. Honestly, I think I like the stone one better because it uses less stamina. How much does that use? This uses, um, 27. Yeah, this uses 15. I'm gonna actually stick with this. Yeah, I mean, it's fine. Oh, look at that. Break out for me, will you? God, there's three of them. Alright, well, this should take a while, but I should be able to get it done. Yeah. Oh, God, they're out! Damn, they didn't take long. Alright, I'm not playing games with these guys. Come on, run straight. Okay. Okay. Probably get this guy with the hammer. Okay. Where's my arrow? I blew up his head. <laughs> I couldn't get my arrow back. Whatever. All right, well. You know, I, I don't feel comfortable fighting those guys melee just yet. So, probably not the best idea shooting off the gun in the middle of a town, but... You know, it seemed to be okay. Okay. Come on. There you go. How much lockpicking? How lockpicks? Four? Okay. Let's give this a shot. Really hoping nothing sneaks up behind me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I got quests to do, bro. Probably not the best use of my time while I'm trying to get those uh, nucks. I mean, but whatever. I got till day seven. I'm going to get them today, though. So, is that the last one? That's the last one. Okay. Fair enough. Go to hell. <laughs> Go to hell. Oh, boy. Did not see you. There you go. Is this the building? Hey, this might be like the first building I've ever done a quest in. I think this is the building I did my first set of quests in when uh, Alpha 18 first went live. That's cool. I like that. What we got in here? Loot the cars, man. Maybe I'll get me a pick. That would be wonderful. All right, got a couple more cars here. Three more cars, and then we'll go inside there and get the quest done. This is the last quest. We'll be able to afford our Hoosie What's It after this. And then I will start pumping points into uh, the brawler tree. I might wait until I've uh, put a couple... Did I not loot that? There we go. I might wait until I've put a couple points into the brawler tree before I actually start using the Nux. But I still want to get them. And I'll try them out anyway. They have no range. I'm going to get hit using them. So um, that's a bit of an issue with that. But once you get full into the fortitude tree, it doesn't matter. You're just... You're freaking... You can't be touched. Well, I don't know. Maybe, maybe on insane difficulty, 250% damage. Well, only the damage part of it. Um, I might be able to get touched, but... Alright, let's do this. This is going to take so freaking long. Longer than I want it to. Um, but better be safe than sorry. Put that over there. Put that down there. Alright, you know what I'm going to do? We don't really have a lot of time for this sneaky thing. Let's 
do that. And upgrade it. And then we'll do the same thing right here. Yep, he's in the middle. Okay. That's what I thought he might have been. I couldn't see him, though. Sorry. We're going to do this a little bit quickie. I, I like to do the sneaky headshot thing, but it just doesn't make any sense. I got to get this done a little bit quicker than headshot sneaky would allow. Come on, guys. There we go. Anybody else? Hello? I'm making all kinds of noise. Oh boy, there he is. Okay, come at me, bro. Come at me. Look, you can hit me. You can hit me. No, you can't. Got to repair that. I'm not going to upgrade it. Don't look like anything in here is going to hit hard enough where I need to upgrade it. Is this it? Okay. Might be it. I feel like the zombies. It's not, a, it's not a big POI. It's tier one, so. Come on. Give me duct tape, glue, or mini bike parts. Any kind of vehicle parts. Oh, that gas one's going to be useful. That was another tough one. That gas one, I think a couple seasons ago, I had a real hard time finding the gas recipe. Oh, that's one less wheel I have to make. And four repair kits. Beautiful. Now I can repair my shovel. Oh, there's something on the roof, huh? Oh, okay. That's interesting. Can I get through here? A little dark back here, I know, for you guys. Don't worry. Won't be back here for long. I get a, head, a headlight or something. Helmet light. All right. I'm going to finish up down here before we go upstairs. I'm also going to grab that cobblestone. I know it. I know I didn't grab the cobblestone in the last couple buildings I was in, but I was just kind of like, you know, in a hurry to get good weapons and feel a little bit more comfortable. And I do feel a little more comfortable now. So now we will start grabbing that cobblestone when I feel it's appropriate. It's not always, oh, uh, it's not always useful to like grab that stuff when, you know, when you, when, you, when you have other things to do, you know? Time is a resource, you know? Jesus. Can't hit this guy. I'll get him. There we go. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. Loot everything in here, because you need it. Come on. The guy's getting thirsty and hungry. There we go. Come on, loot, fool. You can't loot and tr eat at the same time or drink. Okay. Ooh, S is important. Uh, scrap that, throw that out. I'm not taking coffee. I don't need it. I don't care about it. I don't want it. Ah! Jesus! You scared the crap out of me. I did not expect that. I was all looking in the roof. <laughs> Man, that was scary. Oh, boy. All right, let's do this. There you go. Right in your jaw. Could you imagine getting head hit with this thing in your jaw? Let me turn off my timer. We're going to go a little long here. I'm not stop until I get those freaking knucks. Come on, come on, come on. This place is a little bit bigger than I thought. Come on. Okay. Uh, there might be something up there. 
Let's take a look. Uh, no, just trash. That I can't reach. I don't know why I'm going out of my way to get this trash. People keep telling me trash is great. Okay. Alright, let's go on the roof. Uh, we should probably find the supplies first. They're down here somewhere. There they are. There. Now if we die, we at least don't fail the quest. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm a break side kind of guy. Oh my god, there's still more to loot. Come on. Faster! Uh, right. Ooh, that's nice. I like the pistol. I really do. I'm going to put this down here. I'm going to scrap that, eat that. Uh, scrap. 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 Do I have duct tape on me? I'm not seeing any. Okay. Uh, I could buy the food. I'm going to leave it alone for now. Oh, did I not loot this? No, I didn't. Wow, my third mining book. All right. There's going to be vultures up here or what? Hold on, I'm going to be a little bit careful up here. Shooting him with a with an iron crossbow bolt would have been a waste of time. Is that it? Anybody else? I'm not seeing any vultures. Okay. Oh, hold on. There we go. Old sneaky sneak. Grab that. Oh, oh my god! Two pieces of iron, green iron armor! That's a plus five upgrade, and that is a plus eleven upgrade. Wait, no it's not. It's a plus one upgrade. Okay, let's see what we get for reward. Hopefully it's a pick. That would be really nice, but the real reward is gonna be the spike nux. Thank you, Survivor. Alright, you know. I guess I gotta go with this one. I mean, that's pretty useless, but... Well, I mean, I could probably sell the other things. They don't even sell for that. Actually, this sells for the most. Alright, we got any more jobs? I don't do any more jobs, but... We're gonna go ahead and take I that clear zombies. Use some help. Godspeed. There we go. And let's go ahead and buy ourselves some steel nux. That is an unbelievable find at this time. And I barely can afford it. Wow. Just an unbelievable find at this point in the game. Just insane. All right, guys, we are going to call this one here. If you haven't enjoyed the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. All right, a little bit of post commentary for you super fans who, you know, stick around to the end of the video. Yeah, I forgot to get the cobblestone. <laughs> I want to get the looting done. It's just the cobblestone. It didn't, wouldn't have taken that long. I just, you know, I just forgot. What are you going to do? I'm getting, re I'm getting re ready to record next episode, by the way. And we're going to hit the Malachi Magachi Tower. It's going to be awesome. See you then, guys.